guys, so the update for the Furl Jellyfish Magic Candy and the Master Mode for Beast Raid is happening today for me uh, inside of the Central Standard Time uh, and the update schedule has been given to us. So it is going to be November 6, 2024, 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. for the KSC time is going to be the maintenance time. And for those of you guys who actually want to know the exact time for your time zone i'm actually going to leave a link down in the description so that you guys know exactly how to find your exact time for the update so if you guys go to the screen uh if you guys look at the screen right now uh this is going to be uh pretty much my google search here and what you guys want to search in this particular area is going to be something like kst to cst which is my time zone or kst to whatever it is and then you guys are going to be able to see a free convert uh it's a website right over here or you could see this one right here whichever one but i like to use this one right here so i'm going to choose the time of when the update is going to be happening or the maintenance is going to be over which is going to be 12 p.m november 6th and you can see that it's going to be happening at 9 p.m november 5th for me in the cst time all right so make sure to try and use this converter i will leave the link down in the description for this particular one it's going to be in cst but what you will need to do is click on the tool section right over here at the top and then you're gonna have to use the time converter and then uh you'll have to you know go to whatever which one ever you have or you just type in ksc to cst uh, or whatever you guys have for your particular time zone, all right? So with that quickly out of the way, let's talk about the things that you want to do and what not to do when the update happens. So what to do before the update and what not to do after the update, all right? So first of all, it's going to be all this stuff that is going to be disappearing or resetting. First, the Burning Spice, uh, you know, banner is going to be disappearing for this particular uh, update, all right? So this gotcha is going to be disappearing in the next nine hours all right so make sure to use all of the rest of the pulls that you have if you guys are super close to the pity copy and you guys have no burden in spending it might be not a bad idea to spend if you guys do plan on playing this game uh you know for the long term or at least if you want to enjoy the arena side of things just because Brandy Spice is going to be used greatly right now but of course that decision is going to be up to you please do not make any financial or uh, you know purchases based on my words everything is gonna be dependent on what you feel but I'm just saying 250 if you're really really close to it like you're 240 or something like that then it might just not be a bad idea uh, to spend a couple bucks to get to that pit so that's gonna be it uh, of course the banner for golden cheese as well as smoked cheese is going to stay uh, for some time still next thing is going to be that the theme of the cookie is going to be coming out so you're just gonna have to decide which one you guys want to go for and that is going to be coming out just realize that next one is going to be that the legendary costume for black pearl is going to be also disappearing as well so if you guys do want to still want to pull for this one then please try and do so legendary costumes are hard to pull just keep that in mind uh, and also just realize in December they are planning to release uh, Frost Queen's costume as well. All right, so just keep the those things in mind. Um, and of course, you want to take advantage of all the events and the daily stuff. Uh, something that I would tell you to do is right now the reset didn't happen. But once the reset happens, I would say do the today's bounty, do the uh, you know the stuff that daily stuff that you're able to do, and let the maintenance happen because every sing single time uh, it's been a while apparently, but uh, if you guys do do the daily or the bounties, uh, it will reset after the maintenance does finish. So uh, that has been something that I have tested out. Of course, I can't guarantee that it will happen every single time, but uh, it has happened in the last few updates that has taken place. So that is something that you guys can take advantage of if you guys would like to do so. And the next thing that I want to let you guys know of is going to be the beast raid. So if you guys are going to be farming for the master mode, then what I would do right now is probably just spend like one ticket or so. Uh, let it refresh because that is going to be refreshing in about six hours. And then um, either allow your, uh, you know, ticket to refresh until master mode or, uh, you know, just wait and not spend the ticket so that you can farm the master mode instead. That is up to you, of course, uh, if you guys are going to be trying out for master mode. 
Uh, so just keep those things in mind as well. And then the next thing that I want to let you guys know is uh, something that I would probably suggest you not to do is level up for jellyfish's magic candy as soon as it comes out. So as of right now, just by looking at it, Frill jellyfish does look like Frill jellyfish can be used inside of PvE. Uh, but one main thing is that there is a chance of Frill jellyfish being used inside of the Living Abyss to replace someone like Twizzly Gummy because of the fact that you're able to snare. Uh, immobilize the enemies as well as you're able to go and give some extra crit damage uh, to the allies. So there is a chance of uh, Frill Jellyfish actually being uh, applied to a Living Abyss team but because the testings are going to happen right I would say just wait like a day or two on it wait for my review wait for the others review wait for the decision that hey this is going to be something that you want to invest in and then I would invest in that afterwards just for most of the players so that you know uh, hey this is what's gonna be taking place if you guys would like to spend on it then spend on it uh, if you're not then probably hold off until the next like good magic candy comes out or when the uh, arena right for the epic only comes out so that you know hey this cookie is going to be used for the epic only and you want to spend it on it uh, if you want to use it for that particular one then go for it but just just something that i want to suggest you guys uh so that you guys are not like you know spending and uh wasting your resources when you don't need to as of right now right away uh so those are the things that i want to let you guys know of and uh, want to remind you guys of all right so as of right now, that is going to pretty much be it. Uh, just make sure to, again, take advantage of all of the things that are disappearing. I mean, the event side, there really isn't anything that's disappearing uh, because of the fact that this all started uh, when Golden Cheese happened and uh, all the stuff burning spice kind of just disappeared. It's just that the banner is disappearing. Uh, Beast Ray Master Mode is coming out, so make sure to take advantage of the Master Mode if you guys would like to do so by saving the tickets. Uh, make sure to do the daily bounties uh, before the maintenance and then it should reset after the maintenance as well. Uh, and then just speaking about bounty, uh, I, I'm going to emphasize this every single time, but you guys are able to switch and select the uh, particular skill powder that you want. Alright, so just keep that in mind as well. And then the last one is going to be uh, for Frill Jellyfish Magic Candy. I would say wait on him for most players uh, so that you guys know exactly what you're getting yourselves into for that Magic Candy before you guys actually invest all your resources. But thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys are excited for the update. Uh, it's a smaller update again, uh, but it is happening. And the Kofi, we'll see if the Kofi one is going to be free or not. But check out the other videos in front of you guys if you guys haven't done so already. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys all on the next one.